Hi, I'm Sean Larry from Fitzpatrick's Real Estate. Welcome to The Buzz for Thursday, the 22nd of February. Well, today, standing in the backyard of one of our lovely uh, properties coming to market next Saturday. Uh, as you can see, it's like being in the Botanic Gardens. A bit of action for last week. We had 12 open homes with an average of 5.5 groups through those properties. There was 12 offers with the average price of 391,000, and there was 15 sales with the average sale price of 265,000. There were 16 market appraisals, and again, there were seven properties listed last week. Uh, some listings to check out this week is three Binder Place in Ashmont. is three bedrooms, one bathroom with a single carport. That's listed with Matt Newley for 229,000. And 15 Wonkana Road with Helen, that's four bedrooms, two bathrooms. It's got the double lock-up garage. There's some value there at 415,000. We've also got 60 Atherton Crescent. That's a block of land, lovely elevated position there in Tatton and not much land left in that popular suburb. Um, so yeah, making inquiries to secure that block soon. So continuing on with the theme of frequently asked questions and uh, the buying process, you found a property you've loved, you've had your finance approved, so you want to submit an offer with your agent. So you'd want to submit your price, any conditions, your deposit amount and a settlement time frame. It's important once you do have your offer accepted and negotiated a price with your agent and the owners, that you're prepared to book in with your solicitor straight away. So you want to know who you're going to be using just for your conveyancing, but also your building and pest reports. You want to book these items in as quickly as you can. You also want to move forward to signing your contract and getting that exchanged, because if there is multiple interest in that property and, and another offer is received legally, an agent does have to take that to the owner. So it's important to exchange contracts as soon as you can, just to secure that property for yourself. Once that exchange has happened, it's simply five days waiting for the cooling off period to expire and also any uh, building and pest or asbestos conditions that uh, you're yet to satisfy. Once the sold sign goes up, it's just a waiting, waiting game through to settlement. Uh, do your pre-settlement inspe pre inspection, get the keys from the agent and move in. If you do have any more questions about the buying process, please let me know. But I hope you have a good week and I'm Sean Larry from Fitzpatrick's. Thanks for watching.